everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. So today's video is a really spontaneous one and now that I see everything laid out on my bed, I'm having second thoughts. <laughs> but it's definitely long overdue, it really needs to be done. So I thought today's the day, I'm just going to get it out of the way. I'm sure everybody has the same chaos that they've been putting off and maybe this will inspire someone to get into their cupboard and sort it out too. So I've taken a whole lot of stuff out of my cupboard. You know that stuff that's like at the back of your cupboard that you haven't worn in a long time? And when I say a long time, some of the stuff I haven't worn like in five, maybe eight years. But it's there and like, I don't really consider myself a hoarder. But I guess when it comes to some nostalgic things, I really do hold an attachment to it. So I mean, I do have plenty of memory boxes where I keep things that, you know, things that are special to you that you want to look back on in a few years time. And I guess I've kind of done that with my cupboard too. <laughs> because some of the stuff I haven't even looked at, never mind worn in years. So I really want to make a few piles. One that I'm going to donate the clothes to charity. Another pile of stuff I want to keep. And the third pile is stuff that really just needs to go. Like there's no salvage in it. It's just, I've had it too long. So yeah, I've really got my work cut out for me. Um, this is only some of it. Let me show you. So yeah, <laughs> there's so much, so much. There's dresses, skirts, everything. So without further ado, let's get into the video and try on these clothes. Hopefully they fit me still. So this first one is a top I got from YDE quite a while ago, but it is super cute and I love the color. So I'm definitely going to hold on to this one. This next one is from Woolies. I love the color. I love the detail. Like the back has such a nice zip. The zip, however, is really cold on your back. Especially today, it is like super cold, but um, I just love the way it looks. The zip is just too pretty. I love the color. I hate the fact that it gets crinkled so fast. Even though it creases fast, I'm definitely going to hold on to this one. Yeah, I should definitely hand it up rather than fold it so that it won't look like this half the time. This one I got from YDE. I'm definitely going to keep. It gives me major beach vibes. I just love the crinkle pattern on the back. And the buttons have little anchors on. So it is so cute. I just love this one. I love the color, everything about it. So definitely a keep. <laughs> This one is from YDE. I had full intention of letting it go, but now, I don't know. Now that I look at it again from far, I'm not so sure about it. You see, it's got this like, I don't know what you call this. It's like, it reminds me of a curtain, that's it. It's like a curtain and it like drapes like that. So it's really cute. It's got a nice bow at the back and everything. And I love the color. Like I don't have any other dresses that are like purple. So I really love the color. I love the style. I like the crisscross here. And oh, slip to the back. It's got like a nice like diamante finish to it in front here. But I don't know. Mm, I think I'm gonna put it in like a maybe pile. Like hold on to it for a week and see. I mean, not like I'm gonna go anywhere right now and wear something like this, but it's just, I love the color and it's like brand new. I've worn it maybe like twice or thrice. You know, I feel like I've loaned it out to people to wear more than I've actually worn it. It's that type of dress, but it's cute. I like the color. So yeah, I think I'm gonna keep it because of the color and like this over here, like the little straps, but I'm not a fan of this curtain. <laughs> not gonna lie. I mean, maybe there's a way I can like, oh, that just made it worse. Like pin it up, it's more of a drape then. <laughs> I don't know, but um, it's cute. I definitely want to keep it. Now this one definitely does not fit, but I was reluctant to film it, but you know what? We're honest on this channel. So I just want to show you because it is super cute. I just love this little cuff. It's such a gorgeous design, but yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> if I let go of these buttons, <laughs> it's not going to be good. As cute as this top is, and I'd love to keep it because it's just so cute. No, today I am clearing out my cupboard and I'm not going to be nostalgic and hand on to things. It is such a lovely style though and I love the buttons and I love the like um, the design on it, you know, like the black and white and this little cup sleeves and it's got a collar. So it's it's really cute, but someone else can enjoy it. So this next one's from True Woods and I love this top. I've been holding on to it for a long time, but I think it needs to go. Um, I know you're probably thinking like, why? It's a gorgeous top, but it's got this like overlap pattern here, which I love. But the thing is, it's got the same overlapping pattern here down below. And if I stand to the side, like this top has always made me look pregnant. You see? <laughs> and I don't like it. I just feel like if I stand by the white, like because of the layers, it just has that overlapping style that makes you look pregnant. So it's a maybe, but I think at this point it should go because I haven't worn it in a long time. This next one is a dress I got from Mr. Price quite a while ago, but I 
absolutely love love this color it is gorgeous emerald green and it's definitely a lot snugglier than i remember it being especially on the arms but it's all right it still looks good i think and i love the back like the detail at the back is just gorgeous so i'm definitely gonna hold on to this one a bit longer too this one's from YDE. it's cute i love the straps but it's kind of like a, a bubble like <laughs> i don't know i'm go the the back so you can see so it like cuts off here and then it's got this like bubble effect which is cute and all but i don't know i've had it too long i'm over it now so i think i'm gonna let this one go this is another one from ye i really like the design um as you can see when i got them up close it's got like nice little ruffles here and on the side as well it's got the same pattern it's pretty much like a corset but like it fits well and it looks really cute especially with the jeans as well so Gonna hold on to this one too i think i have a problem i want to hold on to too much but they are going to be things i'm going to let go of so this dress i got from soto and to be honest i don't even know if soto is still open like i've had it quite a while now it's one of those dresses like you will just not miss me in a crowded room <laughs> it is so bright um but it's cute and it's comfortable but i don't know if i'm gonna hold on to it because i've only worn it about twice um i've had it like once on an instagram photo i'll insert the picture here for you but i don't know <laughs> I'm gonna give it some thought, but at the moment I'm leaning towards letting this one go, I think. Yeah. It does have quite a nice like ruched pattern here and a little bit there on top. So it's got a lovely design to it, but I don't know. I love pink, but I'm just not sure it's the right pink for me. Okay, this one I think is definitely a keeper. I love this turquoise here. I think it's so cute. Also, I just want to apologize about the lighting because like I didn't realize how long it was going to take me to try on all these outfits. So the sun is starting to set, but I'm sure you can still see, but the back is so gorgeous. So I do want to hold on to it because of this gorgeous design at the back as well. I just think it's a nice color, you know, like it's, the turquoise really pops with the black. So I'm going to hold on to this one too. <laughs> I know I've been saying that for a lot, but it's just so pretty. So yeah, this one too. So this dress I'm absolutely obsessed with. I think it is the perfect summer girly dress because of all the frills and it's got a lovely pattern on it as well. It's like daisies. I love the crisscross pattern at the back. And it's got this like um, ruffles going here as well. It looks like a, a wrap dress, but it's not. It's just got like a flap here. And obviously there's a zip at the back, but it's just so pretty. <laughs> Another dress from YDE. I have definitely given them way too much of my money, but I mean, their dresses are just so cute. I just love the design. Like, I love this red. I think this red is so beautiful, and everybody keeps saying red's my color, so <laughs> I ended up with a lot of red clothes, especially dresses. So I love the design. I love that it's got like a thick strap, and like, it's also got like little pleats going down, and then it's like tighter, like at the bottom here. But it is so cute. It's so comfortable. Like, it feels so so silky that's what really attracted me to this dress when i first got it is that obviously the color the color is stunning like it's beautiful i love this red with a perfect red lipstick it, it just makes a perfect outfit <laughs> so i'm definitely gonna hold on to this one it's like silky almost it's gorgeous this color so i just wanted to show you this one as well but i'm definitely gonna hold on to this one it has been in my cupboard for a long time um definitely haven't worn it out much <laughs> but ah, there'll still be a time where i will wear it so this one's also from YDE. I probably spent way too much time there as I'm realizing now, but I just love their designs. It's so gorgeous. It's like red underneath and then it's got this lace. So like up close, it's like really pretty. <laughs> so yeah, I'm definitely gonna keep this one. This one's from YDE again, and I think it's so pretty because it's so silky. Again, seriously, what was I thinking with all this like curtain style drape dress? <laughs> It's such an interesting design. Like my hands can go right through here. Like I, I don't know. It's a funny design. It's got like a gap here where literally you can put your whole arm in and then, I, I don't know. I love the design. It was complex. It was pretty. It is still pretty, but I feel like I have so many blue dresses that I don't know if I should actually keep this one. I'm not sure. I don't know. Let me know down below in the comments if you think I should keep this navy dress or not. So the problem is like I want to let it go but then I remember all the fun times I had like wearing this dress and like it is actually a gorgeous dress. Me trying to like make reasons to keep the dress but it is pretty and I mean like like you can see the stuff is like I've had it for years but it's like brand new like 
So this dress I've always been in love with, but it is problematic at the same time. It is so pretty. I love the black and white pattern and it's got like um, a nice like crossover pattern here. The back is pretty. It's got a nice like overlapping design. But <laughs> when I say it's problematic, like you have to sit very still because not because it's like really short. I mean, it's not that short, but the thing is like each one of these white flaps can lift up. <laughs> And when it does that, like at the back, it's like sewn in, like where the zip is, it's sewn in, so it can't really like flash anybody at the back, but it can like lift up here and then you'll show some skin. Doesn't look too bad, but then is it's like everywhere. So that is kind of problematic. So like, obviously when you sit in, it does ride up a little bit and it can flap a bit. Like there you can see it's flapping a little bit in the wrong place, <laughs> but yeah, it's flapping a little bit as I'm busy talking right now. So it's it's kind of problematic. What I always find when I wore this dress, the easiest way to keep these frills down is every time I'd go to the bathroom, I would unzip the whole thing because the zip goes right down to the bottom. And then, um, oh, I also like the way it comes up there at the bottom. I didn't really take note of that till now, but it's like a nice point, which is cool. So like, yeah, as I was saying, every time I would unzip it, then I would take it, flap it out, and then re-zip the whole dress up so that it would be perfectly flat like this. <laughs> but yeah, it is problematic, but it is gorgeous. I have considered, you know, like trying to sew it, but like this like is a mesh material that's quite difficult. And I don't want like all the stitching on here because like it's so pretty and silky. Um, but I think maybe like a dot of fabric glue, like a few dots here and there, might hold it down in place. So I'm gonna see what I can do because that's it, it's like, it's one of a kind, it's pretty, so. I think I'm gonna hold on to this one. Okay, this is one of my favorite dresses. I don't think I could ever let it go. Like the design is just so pretty. So it's like a bodycon dress. And then on the sides, there's like a lace cutout. So on both sides, you got the lace cutout. And I just think it's so unique. I haven't seen a dress like that. That's got a cutout, like going towards the middle like that. And it's also quite a short dress. And it's got like little like lines sewn into it like that. So it's got like a nice pattern to it. It just fits so well and but then again it's another navy dress and i own so many navy dresses but i don't own any that has like cut out actually i do <laughs> it's another black dress that has a cut out like lace at the back um but i don't have a navy blue one with a cut out so i think i'm rather gonna ditch that previous navy blue one and hold on to this one so this is the little black dress that i was referring to when i said i got another dress that has lace at the back i am keeping this dress 100 percent because it is so gorgeous it has like a nice cow neck type style i think that's the right way to say it it's got ruffles you see how the whole thing is like ruffled like that <laughs> and how do you explain it um it's so cute it's got like little straps the back is my favorite oh my gosh when i saw the back of this dress i fell in love with it straight away um obviously you need a different bra because it comes quite low the um lace but it's so pretty it's just it's so comfortable, it's so classy, elegant. I just think like it's a gorgeous dress. So yeah, I just wanted to show you what it looked like, but I'm definitely holding on to this one. I think this one, yeah, yeah this one is also from YD, definitely. <laughs> See why I love their dresses? I just can't part with it. It's too pretty. Definitely have a lot of short dresses from them. I should really look into getting some long dresses from YD as well. So this one is really gorgeous, but to be honest, I can't remember the last time I wore it. It's got a beautiful lace crossover top and a peplum style that's how old this dress is who remembers the style of top and dresses like everybody had those but i love that it's got lace all the way around and then <laughs> the style going around the whole dress it's cute I, you know what i really love is the color like i don't have any beige dresses come think of it this is the only beige dress i have and like the cream and the beige just work so well together i just don't know about the style because the style went out quite a while ago you don't see anybody wearing it anymore but it's cute. It really, it fits so well. It's got like a nice fit to it. So I'm gonna put it in the maybe pile for now. So this is an infinity dress in a beautiful pale pink color. I'm not sure if you can really tell. Um, there the lighting's coming a bit for us. <laughs> so yeah, it's pretty, but it's knee length. And I think like if I ever get one again, I would definitely want a full length infinity dress because there's so many designs you can do with it. So for that, I really like it. Um, I love the design at the back. You know, there's so much you can do with it. The bow, the crisscross, the little diamante detail there. So it's pretty, but I'm gonna let it go because I just wish it was longer. I don't like a knee length one at all. And to be honest, I haven't actually worn it out. So this next one's from YDE. 
And at first I really like the lace pattern, but I actually haven't worn it. So underneath it's just like plain white and then it's got like a little bit of black frill here. And then the lace goes over to complete the look. But it's just not me. I don't think it really like looks that great. So I'm definitely gonna let this one go. So this dress is also from YDE and it's such a beautiful silky material. It's got a nice halter neck as well. And to be honest, something about this dress, every time I put it on, I just wanna go like salsa dancing or something. And I have never done that in my life, but it's like, has a nice frill to it. So it's longer on this side and short on this side. And it's like, I don't know, <laughs> it's a fun dress. So you know what? Life is short, we should have fun. And I'm gonna hold on to this one because it makes me happy and it's like just brings out a fun side. So <laughs> I'm definitely gonna keep this. Plus, this color is quite gorgeous. Like, I don't have many dresses in this color. I know I say that a lot, but I genuinely do not. The only one I had similar to that was this one. Kinda similar. But yeah, this black one with the like turquoise top. The only one I had that was like similar to this one, but this is a different shade of blue. And like I said, it makes me happy. So I'm gonna keep this one. Now this dress, absolutely love. I wish I could keep it. I mean, I suppose if I alter it, I could, but I just don't see when I'm gonna wear it again. So I think I should rather let it go. Um, but it's a beautiful champagne color. And it's got like this lace over it. And I actually bought this when I was eight months pregnant. I got it from occasions. So it's full length right down to the bottom. <laughs> And um, yeah, when I bought it, it had a zip. So I had it altered already. I had this crisscross put in so that it would fit like a lot better around my belly. Um, but now it's like, yeah, I mean, the zip should definitely come back. And even with the zip, it's, it's just like around the sides, it's very loose. I don't like it to fit like that. So it would need a lot of altering. Plus it's really long. I already had it altered so that it wouldn't be so long. Um, but it seems like maybe I've gotten shorter or, <laughs> I just need to put that high, high heels on again, and then it might be the right length again. But yeah, I've decided already that this one's gonna go. I just wanted to show you how pretty it is. So this one is just gorgeous. It really is one of a kind. I think it is stunning. I fell in love with it the minute I saw it, but I just don't know where I'm gonna wear it again. But I mean, it really is so pretty. Yeah, so it doesn't have sequins at the back. It's just got like a little zip, so about there. Um, but it's pretty, I don't know. I love that it's like gathered up like this. It's from Bride & Co. Um, the design is Viola Chan. There are two straps that came with it, but I've never actually ever put the straps on. I've always just worn it as a boob tube dress. It's a nice perfect length. It's got like nice ruching. I don't know. It's so pretty though. Uh, I feel like I want to hold on to it for a little bit longer, but at the same time, like someone else can wear it, you know, like if they have a special event to go to or anything like that. Um, I haven't worn it in, a year and a half. Yeah, the last time I wore it was to a work Christmas party and I haven't worn it ever since. But I mean, it's just too pretty to be sitting in the cupboard the whole time. I don't know, oh, I'll see. I think I've worn it twice. I wore it once to a wedding and once to a Christmas work function. That's it. Been in the cupboard since then. <laughs> so we'll see. <laughs> Put it in the maybe pile, leaning towards the donate pile. <laughs> So I ended up with two piles in the end instead of three. And I said I was gonna have a pile for like trash that I was gonna throw out. But I mean, now that I look at this clothes, even though it's like super old, some of it, like it's in really good condition because I barely wore it. So I'm rather gonna take all the stuff that I'm not gonna wear anymore and donate it to charity and then the other pile I'm gonna keep. And I'm looking at it now and it looks kinda even. Let me show you. So this is the pile of stuff that I'm gonna end up keeping. I just love so many of these pieces, like, you know, once lockdown's over and we go out again, I feel like I'm definitely going to be able to wear some of these dresses again. And they fit well, they look good still, and I just love all the different colors and styles. So I'm going to hold on to those. This pile over here is all the stuff I'm going to donate. Obviously, this top you saw is a little bit small. I didn't try on the skirts. It's just like a plain red skirt. And this one's like purple, and this is like a nice corduroy skirt, but it's like super short, so... I don't see myself wearing that, especially this white one is like really short as well. So I've just added that in plus this gorgeous dress and the pink dress. There's quite a lot of stuff. So I would say like the pile of stuff I'm going to donate, this is the pile of stuff I'm going to keep is pretty even. 
So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed going through all this clothes and sorting it out into what I'm going to keep, what I'm going to let go. And I kind of feel like the pile of stuff I'm letting go is a little bit bigger than the pile of stuff I'm keeping. But the main thing is there's stuff that is going to go. So <laughs> I definitely needed to sort this out a long time ago. And you know, as the time goes on, if I don't end up wearing those dresses, I'm definitely going to give them away too because there's no point just holding on to it. I feel like the fact that I'm still wearing this dress, I'm going to end up keeping it. It was in the maybe pile, but I think I'm going to end up keeping it because it's a beautiful grey. As you can see, I love grey. I've got a lot of grey in the house. And I just feel like, you know, it's kind of me in a dress because I love anything that's sparkly and glitters. And the sequins are just shining and sparkling so beautifully. So I'm definitely going to hold on to this one. But I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a like down below. And I'll see you real soon with a new video. Thanks. Bye.